I mean, howdy, do we say, do, do, what do we say with them American? Hi y'all, hey y'all, Murray, Murray new season, hi, I'm on from, on today, watching, two o'clock. This, uh, <laughs> SAFC versus SAFC, we have a defiant bit, and, hello, Paul Wilson, where? Good morning. I'm surprised anybody's up this morning. <laughs> if you're in America, excuse me, Frank. Oh, we'll, we'll see how well. Right. Do I need my trust me? <laughs> it's a pre season friend. Nah, I mean, it's a friendly, it'll be quite <laughs> And it's in America, who cares? So, slightly the only, the only American in our team is Gooch. I know, that's really weird. There's no. He's there's... captain as well. He'll, he'll be a translator for us. There's, there's actually a, um, an Englishman in uh, San Antonio's team as well, Smith. We've traded for Wait, the is the stream is the stream live? Could be. Oh it is. Yeah, yeah, sorry, I had to refresh. It didn't refresh for me. Oh, you got a haircut. I got a haircut yesterday, yes. Oh, oh wait, I should have noticed it was in your bloody video earlier. <laughs> yeah, I will tell you what, you do have a really nice away kit for this season. A lot of people really don't like it though. I think it's really nice. I tell you what, it's better than some of the fucking Premier League's away kits next season. But not the only pink away kit. Is quite got the, the um. Team. The other team had a pink kit. Uh, I'm gonna have to look it now because they want a video on it. And yeah, that's what they're. Uh, part of. I kind of have a pink kit just like us. It's got like chevrons. Um, uh, it's kind of like it's made by New Balance. You can't see what I'm saying, can you? Uh, <laughs> let me put it on. Put it on. See the case. Why is it not that? Uh, you know what? I'm not being a very good scientist, I guess. Two o'clock in the morning, don't. Uh, can you see that? Ooh. Hang on, I'm waiting for stream to catch up. <laughs> <laughs> very pink. It's a nice kit. That's nice, sir. Oh, the city one. Yeah, they've done the monochrome badge as well. That works. Using stuff on it's unique it's a it's a it's a one off thing it's nothing to scoff at yeah slightly new slightly slightly new layout um can you keep me updated with scores please Harry yes I will um, I don't think Dunley have on his team he yeah. I'll try my best to do it. Chat me about <laughs> um, some off topic, off of things if the game's cool. Um, <laughs> the game's cool. It's a pre season friendly. There's even going to be like 25 goals or not. It, it, there's no. 25 goals. Open. We're going to have to. We're gonna have to see if we can what well, what like the thinking of the program is like. Um, so have you, you, you can see my uh, overlay on my stream, right? This is what it's gonna like like in the league tables. I have like stats and stuff. Um, no league table in it. I that, but then that creates a lot. <laughs> it's been 
quite are we? The stats to here then. YouTube Premium, baby. YouTube Premium? Yep. I can, like... So I got your stream up. So I can, like... Go on Discord, and I still have your stream in, like, the top corner of my phone. <laughs> Great. Right, so I'm gonna... Okay, I'm gonna go to um, there's no timer on there anymore. So I can't sync out. Is the audio cut out for you on the on the stream, on the actual football? Yes, I thought that was me. Okay, all right. <laughs> I was going. I'm. I'm not going crazy. Well, I was going crazy. Is it bringing out like a? San I was Club? thinking that. Mm -hmm. Friendly maze. I believe that we will win. I believe. I believe. I believe that I we will win. <laughs> but, um, I didn't actually realise San Antonio in the MLS. Rather not, Max looked at it earlier. The win this. That's what? In the, they're in a different league competition. It's MLS adjacent. Basically, they have the same structure as MLS. Um, not in the same tier. Uh, it competes in the USL Championship, which is the second highest level. They have a second tier, and they have a lot of second, but it's obviously not a franchise. MLS. This is the most American thing I think I've ever seen. But the flags, yeah, it's not. Uh, not flares off now. Oh, I just realised what I could put there. Oh my god, they got fucking flame things going as well. Py they got pyros. Pyro oh, yeah, cannons, dude! What's this, man? I mean, it it's a nice. Nice. It's a, it's a friendly football game. There's a lot of people there, mind, isn't there? Yeah, there's a few. An old, apparently. Mm. Oh, of... Almost as almost as big as Luton. Basically, yeah. It's not right for the MLS. I know there's a lot more people to put, but it's not a popular sport in America, is it? They're not but look at look at all the people walking past all. Oh, there you go. The, the sound made a return for a couple of seconds. Ago. Oh, oh, we've got music. Yeah, we've got um, elevated music. Pyros are coming back on. <laughs> but with music, I've got to be careful because it could be. <laughs> a moose, welcome along. Oh, I've got... that's playing that music. Um, you can I just on? point something out? Huh? They've got one minute till kickoff and no one's on the pitch yet. <laughs> it's a friendly mate. Like... <laughs> well, that's the tunnel. Let's put this game in. I don't, I don't... If it's gated content, be switched. Oh, there's I think that's why, um, you know, when you and Brad were doing that, but... where's the subs? Have we got them? I don't think so. <laughs> there's no subs been announced. Maybe they'll all get the full ninety. That's in Gucci, Neil Ballard, Neil Rig Bellingham, some some meter. He's me. Come here, come here, Samido. Yeah, yeah. We have no subs. We literally have Robertson no subs. Bar. <laughs> we have no subs. That's what no gets injured. You ain't got no subs. Oh, yeah, Stephen, <laughs> welcome. Good morning. You Steve. haven't got thumbs. I mean, it's a. Oh, can't get injured in this game. Yeah, you don't want any injuries. We, we get don't... injuries, more people have to play. Is he allowed to? Can we get somebody from the stands coming in? Have you seen the shit going on with um, Jordan Henderson? He's going to. He's trying to go to um, 
Um, he's trying and... to, but it looks like he's not going to, which is going to piss off a lot of people at Liverpool. <laughs> Oh my god, have you heard the commentary? Sunderland AFC. We have we have American commentators on it. Yeah, I've got the volume like turned all the way down because like listen, listen to it. It's quite it's very sad to Very sad. <laughs> uh, you... The first time we have commentators we we had no commentator for Shields and Gateshead. I know that's what that's what I was thinking with this one. We we have Americans. Um. So, question. Oh, do you think it's just they've got the mic at the stadium and it's nearest <laughs> people? Um. Where we are. I'm, I want to create a poll, but I think it's been like literally. It's been that long. It's been that long since. <laughs> I want to create a poll. Do you want the American comment on? There we are. Uh, Grant Swindell, he's watching it on ASF A S A F C. Yes, that's how I'm watching. Bloody hell. Same. I check. No, I want to put in. I want to put in poll. Players coming out. S A C. It's an app. Oh, the, oh um, my God! Why are they zooming on some guy's legs? I'll say that. Why does camera work? Ooh. Oh, I just realised they haven't got like an overhead camera. Oh, this is going to be interesting with the camera, isn't it? How's this going to work without an overhead camera? Well, they're all stood up. <laughs> oh, I'll <turn> it with <laughs> the sound. Right. So, I've asked a question. Give it about two, three minutes to get enough answers into it, but... Uh... I'll turn it on for now so you can get a little injury, but he's gonna start tonight. He's gonna be the captain and he's also gonna play as a defender as Why well. Why do they turn to the I side? Marcin is gonna use a little bit of a different look tonight with SAFC. Uh, in the midst of I don't know, they're Americans. They're probably saluting the flag. Oh, hail the flag. The fact they do it in schools is just so weird to me. That's not much fun to do, is it? It's coming up next here on Valley Sports. Huh? Valley Sport, it's on Valley Sports, obviously. Valley Sports. I'm so, that's so, I don't know. <laughs> so Keep going round. I want to say he was from the club. Keep going round. What's going on here then? Oh, oh, have they got, they've got, they're, they're keeping themselves hydrated. They've got water. They've got... What is this camera, dude? What's it doing? <laughs> this is the worst camera work I've ever seen. Are they try are they trying to yeah. They tried to find more brain there? Trying to find funny it's just a you can see his bald spot. He's the third man to see the people in uh, in the bottom left corner. He's the one without the orange Say on his shoulders. Oh my god. Gotta love American. Yes, let's laugh. Okay, yes, let's laugh is definitely winning. Feed, oil, lads. Oh my Putin. god, they're at uh, wait. Uh, I they got the uh, and yes, they have someone singing the U.S. national anthem. Yeah, it is. It's actually somebody, somebody actually said that on the pitch. <laughs> my SFC is it is working. Um. If you're fresh, Goblin, um, I don't know if you're able to join this channel. You have a Discord. How do I share my Discord channel profile? White people? Edit invite link, no limits, I uh, never. 
Uh, you go. uh, you're gonna want to be careful having people in here because they can say whatever they like, basically. No, in this chat, I think it's the this is for the server as well. Just be careful. You have to agree to stop as well. Um, okay, we're now staring at legs. That's... I love the set right for the camera right off John. What are they doing? But honestly... I'm seeing the, the players, um... Like oh yeah, they're doing the walking, but yeah, yeah. The, the screen kind of went black for a minute, and then the camera was just zoomed in on people's legs for some reason. Okay. This is I need to be able to keep up top playing in the number nine. Is over from Benfica in Portugal. He's a striker. Watch this year. Is the match start? No. No. It's only seven. They're only six minutes late. There you go. This is literally the entire team for the entire game. No subs. Hopefully, no one gets injured. I'm loving the music, though. Yes, I'm the real thing. I'm the real thing, baby. Can the real thing save the stand up? And just some of the notes, the average July high temperature in Sunderland is 68 degrees. The hottest to be fair, can you remember the Roma uh, friendly last season as well, where we only played 45 minutes and then it was just like, what the hell's happening? Because they didn't get the, uh, the stadium's lights. I don't think that's going to happen today. The delay kickoffs are alright, I don't mind that. I don't want that close up to Mowbray. Hey, Simon, we have the biggest bench we've never seen today. Um, nobody. We have nobody on the bench. Literally, that's it. Uh, we are playing those players all game, and um, if there's any injuries, you're fucked. We've got nobody to put on. We've got 11 players to put out on the field. It's more players going to put them on. And Alan Tony Wilbury. He's international friendlies here. He's singing to do the Tony Wilbury. Featured against some league Maybe. sides over the last couple of seasons. And bro, it's 2 a.m. My fucking brain is is trouble. It's for it's for it for itself. That is a nice kit. I do like your home kit, man. And so the home kit as well. You like both of them? It's so it's so clean. The pinstripe red. I generally think Sunderland has a better home and away kit than some of the Prem teams this season. You know, not only are we oh, match so acronyms here, we're team colors, so... Uh, have to fix up a bit and... Yeah, see, the lady on the commentary just said, oh, I like those kids. <laughs> those jerseys. It's a little bit choppy, to be honest. Not used to I really like, I really like it. I'm not talking about the kit, I'm talking about the stream. The fourth official. Uh, oh yeah, the, yeah, it's because the camera work is ass, but <laughs> we'll, we'll take what we can get. I'm just happy I can watch the games. It's a nice pitch though, isn't it? It's actual brass. Full screen on... Oh no, 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 no. Sports. Oh, we're 10 seconds into the game. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're, we're in good. We're in good. You actually just seem to type this There we are. Perfect. Probably the same. Uh, I'm gonna uh, wait. What, what time are you at? At 24, 25, 26. Uh, you're a couple seconds ahead of me. If you press live, mine literally just jumped. So. Alright, let me just like. Well oh, we've just been called a port city. Uh, that they are, and that's the beauty of being able to travel with right. your team, and, and you know, just seeing how how they operate when things are just a little bit different and really difficult. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. I closed it down. Goddamn it! Do that right so far. OBS. No, the snapping on OBS. Where the like stuff. Just. Don't know. Uh, uh, right. What time are you at now? 
Uh, one on nine, ten, eleven. Yeah, I'm still a couple of seconds behind it, so It's free. Uh, solely, no, it is five pounds for this game, ten pounds for the free US. The many reserves that are playing here tonight. Expect them as you talk down. Marcina to play very. It's a game. They've I'm all changed their fans by the way. I'm laughing because I'm probably the speaker. Which is down there, right? Over there. I should say that they, if they have to set off the microphone. The match will call the penalties if it finishes a draw. Who's going to take our pen? That's not that's not usual, is it? For friendly? No. And this is wrong. I I I what? In fact, do you know what's even more interesting though? They're mid-season. Oh. Yeah. They go and play in the wind. There's obviously American winters are uh, horrible. Um, they can't really play, uh, especially in the Northern. So they're mid-season. Like, their season ends October. I fucking break some ankles, lads. <laughs> oh, look at that kit! That pants kit! That piece of the evening belonging to San Antonio with PC and Zico Bailey. Oh, uh, no. So... You know the, 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 um, from afar. the people who say they saw Jordy Kidd, I think really it's just the their the the, the, um, San Antonio's Kids, I don't game. think it's... And Bailey. Oh, the 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 right, oh, I think Anthony we might be able to see the match stats. Send it the other direction as you see Zico Bailey. Yeah, should we put the ball to the team that's please. actually on the pitch? Which is another thing that can be pissed. Yeah, a little bit too much pace, not Leaf, enough of, um, of an arc there. Um, Maybe could have used a bend if he was going for that opposite ball, 90. Ballard, Bellingham, Gooch, Cookins, Neil, 09, Big, Tun, Ben. We do have a decent squad, but whether these are good. Sunderland squad it's that brought 26 players on their probably going to be the same for the US other two games. It's going to be in the United States. They got here on um, Wednesday, so they've we, didn't, we only brought 22 players, so we'll have 11 today, 11 for the next game, and then after this to still fit. Yeah, I, have, I have prong crackers downstairs, do I go eat them? <laughs> I think so, we have a nice snack. Uh, there's no match stats today, so... Campaign there. Yeah, I looked at that on Google. I was like, oh, but, oh I'll have a look at like, the lineups and stuff. And it was like, stats won't be posted until like after the game's finished. And I was like, well, that's fucking useful. I don't think they have the same level of stat there. Uh, Luke 09 doing a classic. Mick Nafell yeah. against. Their number the seventeen, which is who's ah, that? It was it was soft. Did he get the ball? Uh, Not really. No. <laughs> Not no. really, mate. No. Uh, no. He took ankle out. He, he destroyed his. I don't know. Is my microphone okay, by the way? Because I'm on my phone. So like opportunity for SAFC. Okay, but is it clear? Yeah, it's clear. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. They're very tight. I I am. That could be. Yeah. Speaking of uh, that loss um, to Luton Town, hey, well, your defense has been on point so far. Crosses in, but it makes a difference because so our defense over the last two games, uh, the last two friendlies have been clear things up pretty there, poor. Maybe just getting um, a little flat footed. Team some of it was three you know, against South Shields, two against Gator. Oh, yeah, didn't you win like 4 3 or something? 4 3 and then 3 2 on the same yeah, day. So I can't believe that. Speed of 5. Games. Short corner here is a That's pretty gnarly. Massive score cool It's pretty gnarly, dude. You can tell who's inside the back for us. He's totally rock squad. Give me some fame. Noggin. Dude. Alright, so I'll put on my Mac and Cap. I don't think I have my Mac and Cap on, do I? How do you describe what's happening? San Antonio are passing it down around the back and then down the right hand side. Look, look in. I don't think anybody's looking to over-exert. Um, yeah. Nah. 
like you said, I think defensively, we're doing all right. Probably got the text of the game going, oh, first and that sounds, that sounds absolutely brilliant for like. He's been pretty um, passive so far. I don't think anybody's looking for exactly. No, I think it's like a they'll they'll take it easy, but like if they get a chance, they'll go for it. You know. The thing is, you've got you got Sunderland who are like preseason; they don't want to get anyone injured. Yeah, and then you've got the team that are in the middle of their season who also don't want injuries playing a friendly. <laughs> I, I don't get why the Americans seem to be to this side. No, I, it makes no sense to me. Maybe it's to build the training. brand national that league. Yeah. Yeah. I think the audio commentary is actually getting better now that we're not in the uh, stone gameplay. In the gameplay game. Game. No adverts, we're just actually talking about the game. Just sitting here in these first few minutes of the game. Yeah, and I'm watching him by uh, SFC and, and quite, uh, Oh my god, no! It's good to see that uh, the depth of this team. Oh, fuck it out. Did you see that? Wait, I'm I'm behind my deep froze. It shows you a clip of some fans that are hard. FC on one side of the piece of paper and FC in the middle like this. Oh, that! Oh, yeah, I saw that. Yeah, I thought you. I thought they scored. No, what? Oh my God, dude! No. Do we need a billboard man up this city or like that? Look at all these dudes. Oops, don't say that. The club might be listening. No, don't do it. Don't do it. How could you deny Ryan Reynolds? But let's see if he scores. I think that's a Does anyone know for free? Dodgy the links, there is dodgy links available. Up there. Oh, 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 yeah. Oh, that was a lovely run. Oh, come on, lads. Come on. Come on. Are you are you ahead or behind? What what time are you at? You're about you're about five seconds ahead of me. I don't know what you're talking about. Still not making any runs. Oh, there they are. Roberts bombing down the right hand side. Come on, lads. Go on. Oh my God. You can watch the game on the road. D1 or D2. Is there an it's issue with now. myself? So, uh, I think a lot of people around England weren't so happy it's about fine for me. not making it back it's into the Prem League. I really want to get you porn crackers, man, but I can't be asked going downstairs and getting them. That's fine, mate. Like, I'll leave, I'll leave. Thank you, Alfie. I can see on the bars the audio is all in peak. None of it's yellow, none of it's red. Oh, please. We're going to one lad. Yeah, have you seen have you seen the um the San Antonio goalkeepers like behind the goal? You can this is Chris Rick. Yeah, yeah, it's rugby. I saw the railing, yeah. Roberts. Everyone's like, oh, the 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 no, the softness, the like anyone who's there. Fine. Is there anyone who paid to see this game? You're a bunch of losers. Come get your hot dogs, five dollars. Have like a... I like the perseverance, man. It's good. Actually, controlling the ball a little bit. It's when are your next? You, you said you got through two more games this week. Yeah. First day at two o'clock in the morning. Okay, well, I'm not watching that. I don't think it's. I don't know if it's Wednesday night or Thursday night. Um, and then again this time it's all 46 matches a year ago. Okay, that's fine. I can watch this one, but I'm not watching Thursdays. I got work. <laughs> Um, I'll, 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 I'll yeah. Yeah. Uh, try to just to have a low before the start of this trip to the FC Wimbledon. Which means their backup keeper tonight is from their U18 side. Yeah, he is. But you don't like to put my streams up to Hedy Hills. 
to go back. Uh, what, what have you done? Have you done that? Backup keeper situation. <laughs> I'm actually refreshed. Right, lucky for them, they've got a little bit on of time 11, to, 12, to get that 15, situation worked 15. out. And what a great yep. opportunity for that young goalkeeper to not only train well. with the team, well, but <laughs> to potentially have an Wait, opportunity what time to at? make it out on the pitch at some point. Great for his soccer resume. Oh, I'm blind. 90 10 seconds ahead of me. Oh. Refresh. Roberts. Oh, it was. Oh, huge. Great work there from Tulu. On. For those towering the presence found Strong. on San Antonio's yeah, the, the back good. line. No, no, it's really Does a great job there to get on the end of it. No, for his physicality and 1v1 huge. defending skills came in clutch there. Foul whistle here. You sound is going back again. Run made from. Joe Bellingham, he is another new signee coming over from Birmingham City, also I know the Championship, championship League. Rob, like, 24 matches for the 17 year old. Patterson. Oh, goal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, Patterson's. Well, the brother, Joe Bellingham, I believe, plays in Inter Milan. Remember, 12 19, 12 20, 21, 22. Yeah, the best players in the world. No, fuck. No. That'll be fine. <laughs> nah, I'll be alright, mate. Be alright, mate. I'm sharing the Discord. Hamir. None of you are watching it. They're excited about this 19-year-old Hamir coming over right. from Portugal and Benfica. Yep. So, so I just cancel that. Benfica That's size, but it, yeah, you may as well. I mean, to be fair, if I probably got rid of Discord and closed YouTube down, I'd be alright, but... <laughs> I'm trying to talk to you guys, mod your stream, and watch the game. My internet's probably having a move on. Boogly boog. Yeah, yeah. Sweet! Patterson, I'm just talking about this good time to sleep. I think we should have Chris with more games this year. Oh, Rick, yeah, um, well, he's passes his GCSEs in, in May, doesn't he? So, <laughs> it's a weird, weird statement that you can have to say about some of the school work. Um, once they're done and dusted, though, he can play a time. He's trying to sidestep Nacho Bailoni. Yeah, yeah. And out I was told to James Copley the other day, have you heard um, Adam Richardson's out for eight weeks? The outside back here, the run for Chris Rigg. Rigg! Rigg! Chris Rigg! 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 Oh my god, oh, yes. for Sunderland AMC, who has a few seconds to win. Do you know any of these people? Their way to Toyota Field for this match tonight. Chris Rigg, the young guy that Sunderland has their pass, highest though. hopes on, gets in off a perfect chip and what a great first time placement. Time placement. It's one of those situations where if you're not coming off the line really quickly, really early, you're not going to get on the end of it. But not much you could do about that situation, especially with a perfect one touch like that. So Chris Rigg. I was just about to say that. Chris Rigg scoring his goal. What a preseason um, he's had so far. The native of Hebron, England. Again, just 16 years of age. Yeah, exactly. Two goals already through their yeah, first three you, matches. You, you could do all you can. Yeah, Sunderland yeah. AFC ahead of San Antonio FC. September. One nil September. in the opening December. quarter hour. You can do it before them. Great. Beautiful chip, all the backspin, it just stops perfectly yeah, right so in front of him. It doesn't require a lot of effort yeah. to get on the end of it either. No, Good and stuff there. And no subs that today, so getting and go, go early means we don't have to go to penalties. Oh. 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 any score predictions. I know that's a, it's a with for league. San Antonio FC. Yeah, so Luton Town is headed to the Premier League the along with uh, Burnley and Sheffield really. United this yeah, year. Which is why I think Luton Town is going to have the smallest stadium ever in Premier League history, just over 10,000 capacity in Luton Town. Oh my goodness. Luton Town Stadium so, in the uh, Premier League. they've got some building and work to do then out there, it sounds like. I mean, that's the great, great thing about, 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 you know, about. promoting <laughs> is that it brings so much attention what to your city, you know. 
these two look at that Netflix documentary oh Sunderland yeah. the community it, it's really a heartbreaking situation just to put that in perspective these commentators don't know what they're talking about you can tell they're like losing to Luton Town was so uh, 75,000 one in 10,000 the uh, other end is it is uh, the first time that Luton Town will be in the Premier League in, more, in their history what an exciting Luton time for their fans this one drops inside the area PC gives it a go and that's the, the beauty of the promotion relegation system, right? It's it gives we're teams to, friendly. to get up there we're, we're into like the, the, the uh, top uh, division uh, and, and build and, and grow, and it means so much for the city. So congratulations to them. I mean, Are again, sorry, like Paul? I said before, so many people in England so really truly believe Sunderland talk. should be a Premier we'll League team the at least <laughs> in the bottom half. Uh, of the lineup didn't think I would say this, standings go, but, but you know, I miss it's all about wins and points, unfortunately, in this game, and um, <laughs> it's what it takes to get one goalkeeper, one right mid, Ahmed replacement, one striker, one set of back to Tammy Bar. If he needs do you still think we need to make four signings out here? Their first year in the championship um, league. Huggins I think we're stacked in the midfield. I still think we have any way too many. Plenty of options on each wing. Ten fives. Strikers. Marty Smith and he's fouled. Back through the middle of the park by Daniel Bailey. Do you not think we've got plenty of centre backs? A free kick opportunity on the reset. No, because I think we're going to go to a back three level. Knock there on the ankles. But yeah, I mean, um, EFL, uh, it's can be something be as simple as six points can be determining factor training, but whether a team is in fourth place or in like tenth place. It's, 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 it's such a close call there in season. that division because so many teams are you fighting for something like a little Stewart. bit bigger. They're fighting to get to the next level. Uh, do you think the teams that were I think he's relegated if he's fit and well and playing. Last yes, year absolutely. Premier League Southampton. But if he's Leicester City, of course, was just a few years ago the magical run by Leicester City that really captivated fans, not only in England but and across the globe. Want to play ever in our and shirts. the other team, Leeds United, which is is, is interesting, they'll hear it back in the championship more than that in a moment. Nico Hansen nearly dispossessed of the ball. Yeah. Hansen tries to give I mean, it a go, that's defended away by Danny Bath. And back up field, here's Abdullah Bach. smashing the hell out of that hole. We'll run on two Thank you. <laughs> ba cutting back to the inside. No be wicked, Ty. run down, Thank learn you. a free kick for Sunderland. Uh, but Leeds United, really going nice. back to the championship, Katie, their no majority no? ownership stake was just sold to a group that is run Thank by you. San Francisco 49ers. <laughs> will feature several American investors uh, you look at and notable yeah, ones yeah, yeah, from yeah, the yeah, sporting yeah. world, including golfers uh, Zach Johnson and Jordan Spieth. And sure Russell Westbrook of the Los Angeles oh Clippers my God, is the latest investor for Leeds United this in. year. Interesting, and ball, but not interesting given. mix there. Uh, yeah, I mean, that's the thing player. about the promotion that and relegation is, system. Um, I know that uh, that system gets a lot of flack here from really America, cool. this highly capitalistic um, society. Uh, they feel like it can at times be a bit of a money pit, yeah, but uh, Rush sometimes it. you it's just need a bigger burst of capital, and once they make it option. to the Premier League, it's kind of a different game. It's all he, he wants to move to. Whatever the moon is wrong, he wants to move to a Premier League club. Americans if have their hands he all over has his eye elsewhere, <laughs> um, I don't think he should be. I um, love how you put that because <laughs> they probably are not a super player. fan by um, um, him. Honestly, when he's back, he's he's the back close. with a header and definitely be awarded back to Carlos Mercado. The, the ownership group um, that runs the Boston Red Sox, the Fenway Sports Group, they are the not, majority owners of Liverpool. Um, do you if think you're not the, interested. The Cronky Sports and Entertainment oh. Group that no, runs no, the Avalanche, the Denver Nuggets, uh, they own Arsenal. So. Um, yeah, and you know, I think says, the landscape of the soccer is changing and go, rapidly here in the United States. Uh, I mean, we have that. the World Cup coming. We have. Um, uh, if that's true, if he hasn't signed it yet, club still. Coming, club World Cup coming. I mean, there, there's so many things happening here. We have the Women's World Cup going on right now, and of course, you know, women. Our women uh, are typically the best in the world in most Shreek, cases. Yeah, yeah. He, well, uh, so still the smart I thing just, I, I see people tuning in and really Makes getting sense. into the sport who never would have, you know, maybe five years ago. So it's it's good to see that things are changing and moving. And I think so, I like this, see this and, you know, you have the ML good, MLS All Star game coming up against Arsenal. Did you see well, that? July nineteenth, oh. I believe. 
Uh, All of these things are so important for the uh, development Supreme. of soccer and for yeah, yeah, everyone they, to they, grow they together. Sunderland AFC up a goal. Uh, the 16 year old Chris Riggin now the tremendous run from young Nile Huggins up the right flank. Sending it back to the top of the 18 yard box where it's off there. The veteran Mohamed Abu. Yeah, we're definitely a stronger team than this. Sterling <laughs> getting instructions from Tony Mowbray, her manager, along the bench. Oh. And again, Rig, Rig finds some space. On Oops, to put in. Gets pushed off the ball. Off the ball. Yeah, that's just there, but another crafty that. run there from the 16-year-old Chris Rig. Actually, I'm really impressed with his ability, just Sorry? his foresight to so you know, get in dangerous to positions. Knows where to be to receive hey, the ball. Nobody, uh, soccer IQ wrong. there. <laughs> gets pushed off Is the that bench, the jingle? But, I mean, I'm pretty sure it is. Old, yeah, he's it is doing actually. pretty good there physically. I think we, I think we got that because it's a. Uh, 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 so good on him hanging out here with these. Is there something I don't like about your kit? It's the big Some fucking older. black circle on your sleeve. Side, I don't like it. That's the his travel sponsor. Well in that does very well. Um, and you don't bite with that though. Well. The teams there is we've got a injury situation collision with Nacho Bailoni. Oh, some of it was me. Going down here. Oh, it's, still good. It's, it still, it's still good. It's still good. Oh, it's uh, SFC stream. Let me just... The Sunderland players that really basically taking any um, opportunity to go get a hydration break. Stop. You mean yeah. stay? Um, I think Danny Bath for them oh, just um, extreme conditions. Degrees tonight at kickoff. I mean, every one of our defenders that we still have. Yeah, it's an extreme yeah, the one I was for anyone. Right I mean, we've been dealing with the heat wave still, in South uh, Texas now for uh, feeling right. basically the last four Trans weeks going back to the middle of June. Well, I was going to say the silver yelling. lining for them is that at least they're getting paid to be in extreme conditions, right? <laughs> So yeah. good for them there. And of course, like, That's if you it, can play through this, you can play individual through game, yeah. quite a bit. I now that you're really 25 minutes into it, though, I'd start to maybe look at the last one in the night. Be tired. San Antonio FC now with a high I press. Sponsor, um, See how Sunderland will play out of it. Should he sell a sponsor? And the giveaway oh, was yeah, trying to yeah, yeah. connect back with Joe Bellingham. It's just, the, it's just huge, like, the logo is like... The tackle there, the ball the ends up the feet of Pico Hansen. Or is the temperature at field level? How would I know that? Um, this is his 69. sixth season as a member of Sunderland, 177 it's matches as a member now. of the senior side now. And on Abdul the lights. Abba, got a wrestle off Connor Maloney, oh, gets his first look at Connor Maloney over He's there on that far flank. Abdul is... Injured. Catching a little bit of a knock is a native of so France. He's got his ankle tread on there. Maloney, one of the hardest workers along the flank in USL. Yeah, because the stadium was on the bench. Uh, Toyota Field. It's like it was a clip there from the behind, and then again. Ooh, they, they literally snaked their legs didn't together. Hoping sprain an ankle there because just got a little bit tangled up. Not yeah, that. that oh, oh, ow. Yeah, that would hurt. Are you getting the season ticket? Yeah. Yeah. No. Oh, you know they call it a friendly, yeah. but. It's really hardly anything but as minutes go by. <laughs> Sunderland will head west to New Mexico to after this match. They will not go as far west as Death Valley. Oh, it's a fucking move. Uh, on. Yeah, off his line. And San Antonio is equalized in the 25th minute. San Antonio returns the favor and by who else other than PC? I mean, he is uh, he one of those foundational well, players of this team. Missed a big chunk the first half of the kick. season. I'm wrecked from and the so, break here. You know, he's one of those Multiple. guys who put him out there. They're looking to work 35. on different things. It's not exactly out. the starting lineup out here, but he can't help but, hey, take a shot from, what was that, half field? Oh, Patterson could have done something like that. Yeah, Patterson should have done a lot better. Patterson was near enough at the penalty spot. He's a little far out. He's expecting him to go to the back but he puts it just That's perfect. Patterson being man, daft. That was a good goal. You know San relieved. Smart. Fantastic from the Why was Paul so far out? Four goals with San Antonio in his career. I don't think none prettier <laughs> than that one in the 24th minute. Uh, also, where can we watch free? Ty, um, you can Google it. That's Maybe a tricky one. You know, most keepers aren't expecting 
a player to take the shot from that far out. Pat Typically, on, you can kind Pat of read that shot. On, all he has times. so much time to travel. But uh, looks like he got caught a little bit flat-footed there. He was expecting Steam maybe the ball to drop a little bit back yeah. behind and just did it. 32. It's probably pulling down now. He said it's a pulse check. Here Why is Sunderland. he stood on the penalty spot? I don't know. San Antonio, <laughs> the equalizer. Know. Levels the match at one. It's a gift for a goalkeeper, not a spot keeper. I think he was thinking they were going to loop it into the far post. You know he was going to go for a punch, but he's also predicted. Yeah, that, that team. Team. One of my favorite things to say is the depth that this was a double size of the guys on the bench the could easily be stars. Some of the best that it is traveling. So I think this is kind of a testament to that. Not only was it a great goal we just saw there, but We've been in their box for a good chunk of this first half. This one to the back post. Easy. Tula got under Easy. it, but drive it wide. Lemon squeeze. Tula who Lemon squeeze. came over you from Hartford that Athletic for them. in a mid-season loan. I mean, no idea five that matches off the bench for Alan Marcina. What number was it? It was former club here. Part of this homestand for San Antonio FC will be the final match coming up in a couple of Saturdays. Hartford Athletic, the Which first ever match up with San Antonio defenders. FC. Basically, it goes to Semedo, get down the middle, Amir, rig, up to rig. Get the ball, passing and it to Bellingham. Bellingham, Bellingham driving forward, getting forward. Curry Bellingham, Roberts, uh, Roberts. To the outside attacking the Parker. Well there Robert's still in his usual thing, trying to like beat his man seven. Wins the ball on field. And Nico Hansen against Is he Eddie fucking not doing good, the yeah. business yet again. Got One a piece of it, Patterson. Is we got rid of it. That's Ballard. He scored that goal. In the direction of Luko 9. Is it Bailey? It's Ed Bailey. Hansen turns those jets on. Uh, it's like a blur. No idea Hockey because I have a club stop puppet on Twitter. work and he does theirs. Really, the showing out for Isaiah oh, Parker here this well, afternoon, I think, is it's impressive just to see the quality defending and doing a great job getting into the attack. Might be their sponsor. Cunningham making the run. How about PC? I think their sponsor's firmly Toyota. <laughs> the Toyota field. Roberts lands to Rig. Trying to cut one for Hamir. Yeah, and no, instead, San so. Antonio oh, back on the counter is Kamarni Smith. What a tackle. A tackle made in the midfield. Right, I've just refreshed again. What time are you at? 28.45. Oh, I'm only three From seconds behind you now. Good <laughs> fucking. Um, headed clear by the San Antonio. You can definitely see where these English guys uh, are getting fatigued, no doubt. We so have Evans coming back in September or October. Legs begin to get tired. Water. So I think we'll okay with play. Evans being in PC beat him to the corner, no, but off on Gucci. Listen, all in all, even, do even it, then, so still maintaining really nice composure. One of the handballs, Niall Huggins. Gucci, Gucci, you. Gives it a go yeah. wide. Who's with your hand? Uh, Bang, what yeah, was that? Gucci. That was yeah, that, shocking. They, they will make a full I've seen him too. roster switch at Billy the half. Shit. Yeah. An entirely different 11 out on the field for the second half. Uh, Evans is <laughs> doing rehabilitation. Doing yeah, situations. I think there's four players Mentally still out injured. On, from uh, oh, we have last Saturday, a couple of games against yeah, the, the hide national the sides opponents. Why weren't they on the team sheet though? But not one of them was on the team sheet. That's but they just the got that many that they didn't want to name them. They just want to surprise us. <laughs> That's what it's meant it's for. A, it's meant uh, to it's learn a, from each yeah, I've other. I've seen them. Um, what's and, uh, the, it's the, the zero gravity treadmills? I've seen We're told do it on them as well. Matches still tied at the end of 90 minutes. So yeah, we'll go it's a good effort from Marnie. Pushed off the ball there. Uh, yeah, Embo's won. Uh, Stewart, Evans, and who else is injured? There's somebody else injured. Seek out. Hmm. Who's playing left back? Huggins or Gooch? Uh, so Gooch is playing down the right hand side, so it's definitely not Gooch. We're, we're currently, um, currently the looking at to watch this 4 2 3 1 formation yeah. with Sunderland here. Yeah. Out of the middle, you see the one striker the here up top. The USL team still play in the 4 2 3 1 is Bailoni. 
Katie, you have momentarily getting past the defender. Ballard. But more clubs, Katie, we've seen over the last couple of years go to what San Antonio does, and that's playing three in the back. He looks like either four in the midfield or five in the midfield. That's such you. As Nico Hansen will attack here, gets upended by Hansen. San Antonio FC will win a free kick just outside the area. It's a really dangerous position for a set piece, and if there's anything we know he does, Place that into the back line. It could yeah, be dangerous. So yeah, definitely. Gucci's definitely playing right. All cleats on that one. Higgins not too happy about it, but frustrations uh, getting a little high. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Looks like he's playing a CDM. It's hot. Come on, show me. Going maybe as smoothly as planned. I want to see a zoom in. A couple of slipping and sliding out there on the pitch too. Uh, it looks like it is. Let's see how they handle this one. Me. Yeah, temperature has uh, dipped to 98. In the 30 minutes plus we've played so far. Bailey punched away. Oh my god, great twice. Patterson, he's Patterson up actually to the alerts there. to the direct shot now from the Great save. His That's end. really good save. Bailey had quite a bit of power behind that. Dying Poms has just said that the game will be back here. If you, yeah, I know. You see with the they want a winner. Bailey through the wall. Patterson gets on the end of it. Great no, no, they, they want to win it because it's um, the draw is not now. entertaining to American audiences, so they decided they want to win it. Well. Which, to be fair, uh, in preseason friendly, yeah, it doesn't really matter, but it gives us practice. For right. We don't normally do penalties. So just to it is actually it's catch their it's breath. Okay, yeah. Subs for. Sunderland already making their way back to the locker room. They've had enough. <laughs> the bench, Done with right? it. Over. <laughs> Done with the first half here and what they've had to endure sitting on the bench so far. Well, San Antonio FC so and Sunderland at AFC Field. break. Together here tonight at Toyota Field. Uh, that is the this seventh is international friendly that San Antonio FC has so far, hosted through at Toyota Field in the second against it. Um, English side Cardiff City was back here in 2019, well. also a member yeah. of the we'll chat about what NFL Championship. No pens. Championship yeah. one level down one. from the Premier League. And, you know, a bit back and forth. Wayne Mirrors so far. USL USL Championship. Back and forth. Going I'd say the yeah. San Antonio has been the best team, to be honest. Those yeah. wondering, that is not a I think they've had a lot more chances. Yes, of course, yeah, again, the, the, you've talked a lot about the biggest difference. European and basically anywhere else where football is played, except the United the States, uh, promotion relegation like factor uh, that that really becomes so much right, there you go. Okay. each and I've every got, year. I've got a face. I've got a face for the right, number and, now. And I can understand Just need to see the number. why investors in the United States, owners of these clubs, would not want to do a promotion that free or a five? system because, case in point, the Sunderland were relegated. The whole city it's a free. took it. Right. It's a right, we've got nobody on this bloody money, list. That's number three. But the main source of income Wait, was it? the Sunderland game. More Bay Point is number three. The crowd that brought it's it's number three. It's so number three who's playing this left back. They're doing to get back There's to nobody top this division. Number three. It's for more than soccer. It's for the entire city. Sunderland playing their matches. Sure. Still yeah, I think you're in the back there. Seats nearly 50,000. And we've got to put it in the situation. It's built stadiums. Yeah, in in all of England, and it is a, a stadium that's built to host at the highest mm. level. They hope oh, to um, be back there after this upcoming campaign, which again will get oh. underway on the 6th of there August. Th their rivals, there's our, there's our their biggest line. rivals, uh, Newcastle in United, two, which five. is the neighboring city in the Tyne and Weir region. Newcastle of Tyne, as it's two, so often referred to. <laughs> and so, if you were to walk around tonight, I know number, a couple of number three, number three is not on this list of players, so that really confused the hell out of me. Their side of choice in England. Hogan's, Hogan's is listed as number two on the apps tonight. But Gooch is wearing number two. Trying to play some mind My games God. with their opponent this evening. Gooch is having a bit of a taking a little that's why yeah, it's, it's, it's Hogan's. Yeah, that's a, that's a great thing about so. whether you're in Division One or Two in England. There's <laughs> always somebody nearby. <laughs> To help keep the keep on doing, doing a bit of a man. So one one here as we come upon the end of the first half. Chris Rigg in the 15th minute for Sunderland AFC PC with a 
screamer from nearly the center of the park. And Isaiah Parker for the opportunity yeah, to San Antonio to definitely having a Patterson. better better time than great footwork there from Isaiah Parker. Uh, good hands by Parker. Hand uh, do, do you want to correct that? Blue to his feet. I I take that back. <laughs> good hands to collect, not Here, to distribute. He commits the fake. He's going. <laughs> Good it was a good collection, then he threw it out, and it just goes straight for a pretty for A lot of these players getting an opportunity to play tonight, and they haven't gotten a lot of playing time, particularly over the last month. I don't think we won. San Antonio FC playing some of their best is soccer here of the season. They have won three consecutive matches in USL Championship after a win against El Paso. Get my brain go. And right now, as we come upon the the middle of July, just a little bit past the halfway part of the season. It almost feels like Al Morsina has third. his set Maybe. 11. And that's going to change, right, of course, week in and week out, yours. depending on injury, depending on who's available. But for the first time, it feels the like the San Antonio FC kind of has a set lineup of 11 guys that they want to roll with Mah each and Mahometi every week. A new right, and <laughs> Tani Oluwaseyi has just so, come in good. like a firework. Yeah. Uh, you know, I'm a, I'm a, the same kind of energy and presence that Sam Adenari brought for them last um, season and of course this season we'll see him go but Tommy doing a great job up there with yeah, Justin Dillon get some, and might get some game time. Time. just to, uh, so many great new additions here for San yeah, Antonio and, and that's why we talk about the uh, 15 goals insane, where are they going to come you know? from and, if we don't have a striker and we've got him here so he might get a 15 can step in and do just as good of a job as the first the first 11 you've got the Hachi can do as a striker uh, nine oh. goals um, in his ten matches. Job. He's the reigning USL he's Championship of player Bar's of the week. Six, seven. Jorge Hernandez has also come on strong. Um, a couple of goals in the last three matches. Clark Justin could, Dillon, Clark could get 15. you mentioned as well. And then it's making it interesting because we've seen well, a couple of times where see Dillon. <laughs> There for San Antonio FC is one of the Tomato's got potential, but he's not starters that's on the, the bench tonight, along with Lamar Batista. Uh, Clark is definitely players that will like be feature here in the second half. But what's interesting is that where you know yeah, every year is a different, a different uh, animal, oh, so to speak. Too. But you know, PC Muhammad Abu, they were the stalwarts in the midfield season. last year in a championship we'll run for San Antonio we'll FC. Against, uh, Ipswich. And this year their roles are a little bit different for the club. Right, and you know, I think the, uh, the coaches realize that you can't necessarily depend on anyone for 90 minutes the entire season. People get hurt and injured, and I think that he realized that with Sorry. PC early on this season, who had to miss a they couple of games. Quite an integral uh, piece of the puzzle there for San Antonio. Miss, miss at the start of the season. Amir, oh yeah, oh ball. what Hamir. strength. That was really good strength from the Absolutely and, and dominating his defender there. A player like Connor no Maloney, bench tonight. who had started every single no bench. match of his San Antonio FC career. There is. There's, and there's literally nobody in the end. When you looked at the, um, over the last month, as you get this last they did opportunity, the pre-match, like what do you call it? From the Portuguese native Amir. There was nobody on the bench. Uh, kind of got a little tired there getting to the end line, but yes, yeah, but where's Jones, Robert, those fantastic people that is on the bench behind him, Morbi actually really brought them on your bike, who are they? Uh, Connor Maloney's duty, he's yeah, a hard player to step in. Number two, number three. Uh, oh, Ballard already are. Yeah. Yeah, he's going to be given that. Reference to Going back to I was going to say if more bit of Ballard that, off, that uh, physical, the only way he'll bring on is um, Triantis. Triantis so, uh, is really a, a good show. Um, he yeah, he's actually there. Bench is just a name. Yeah. Oh yeah, there's loads of players there. There's literally loads of players. There's like nine players available. Like Sidney, Richard, Ekwa. The far touch line, Luke it's basically the full 22 and that's in once again. Um, and there's nobody injured that's Rig. in America, right? It's everybody that's listed. Well here. done from Tulu. Yeah. Great work there. Advantage of being yeah, no, I think he's really doing a couple of youngsters. Strong, I don't know who are all from the youngsters. Uh, Anderson's not a bad show if you're looking for Huggins, defensive. Uh, defensive out on the right flank. But I don't think defensively. Robert's, Coach Moore saying, Riggy run, Riggy run, as Roberts gives it a go with the left. 
and I kind of know the presents the 16 year old on the drum before oh, running Jesus, I was like, at this point. Robert, Roberts needs to, Gasping for there's air. one thing Roberts most really of, needs to change, and it's like, out there on the pitch, but he, looking at his teammates, he tries to do everything wants, himself. He takes a shot, yeah, he tries to like dribble past every. You know, that's what's so hard when you're just gassed. And which is which is all right if you're playing like five aside. Air, it's the uh, final touch, goals, and I think we've seen like that here that. in this first half for them. The final touch hasn't quite been there, yeah. whether it be in the build up or the finish. Aside yeah, from Riggs' goal, that was really it's just solid. a part of his game. Roberts was so phenomenal right, last year shoot, playing Robin, in pass. that outside wing back role. Yeah, right this one's great. Five isn't goals it? in his 42 matches. Why have we not got any money to buy players? We do. Absolutely do. I just think we're. As a member of Sunderland, Looking this is his third year with a club, 26 year old, as he'll win a throw. Which I think is a nice 23 goals for Roberts in the course of his yeah, career. I know the club's looking at um, Nathan Bishop from Manchester United to come in. He's a goalkeeper. Tulo working with Carter yeah, Bentley. Yeah, um, a couple of people mentioned that in the chat earlier on when we were talking about Patterson and about Bishop. Antonio FC will have some Doesn't we do need decisions to make. Patterson's going to make that Saturday's match East when they welcome in Miami uh, FC and Lamar Batista receiving a second make, yellow and a red. The fireworks that exploded at the end of the match on Wednesday night in El Paso it, it is, for a hard challenge on not Jorge so Hernandez. And favorite be both benches emptied. Game, but a lot of cards handed yeah. out. Yeah. Man United has put um, so Bishop's lone move on uh, Jules on hold at the moment. The second yellow to Stan will get a red a one match suspension. Greece with Carter Manley, Alfie. Tulu. Gooch right, Huggins left. Yeah. Likely the two that yeah. would take Lamar's spot Absolutely. here next Saturday night. Having a big lord. <laughs> How do you feel that, Susan? <laughs> what? Toys and lucky win. Get that situation. Ball, Pitch yeah, is cleared. Seven. Who gets the card? There's so much happening. Oh, I've been in the number. Uh, Bailey, there you go. Experience back with goalkeeper. Is Bishop an experienced back with goalkeeper? Yeah, yes, he's, he's had Premier League. Seated in the first half on a penalty. Um, he is. Shoot, I haven't been training. Half, he's been up, not really had a lot of time. Second half brace from Rita Zoo here. I think he's from the academy, I think. On the go-ahead goal, just four minutes after he equalized. Oh, two. San Antonio FC, uh, Experience, though. pretty big win in Copa Tejas at Southwest University Park in El Paso. Yeah, I think the entire squad's on the bench. We just do hear another one of those new additions yeah. that has uh, quite the game. The club in the... Gives it Go on, man. Go on. Go on. This is what Riggin gets, and... Whoa, was right. Made that move better. That was actually out. Roberts and passing it to somebody. There for like, Riggs. It's all, that's Roberts, the difference that. between Roberts right being like, seems perfect. decent and Maybe really, really good. Maybe he tried to take that first touch. Bring Vito on, Minone, Minone back, back good stuff out of the way. Yeah, great he's passed. From, he's from, lost. Why did he try and shoot that with his left foot? Why did he try and shoot that with his left foot? Yeah, but... I don't know. San Antonio has done a really good job of spreading the field. He's taken that onto his right foot. I reckon he scores there. Yeah, he's left footed though. He prefers his left foot every time so he's shooting. He's 16 as well, mate. Uh, when you have two teams uh, playing that way, that means you're covering every yeah, inch when, when you said Serkin's on the bench. Exactly every team plays on the bench. Serkin's not actually on the bench. He's injured. Playing against a club that plays such a high press like San Antonio. Was he in the 22 squad? Yeah, he's in the squad, but the club put out um, in their preview that Zirkin won't, won't feature at all tonight. The same with Jensen Selt. Yeah. the hell, that guy's a tall bastard. That's a bit of an education as well for Sunderland AFC here tonight, too. Spot on there. Completely different experience for them, I'm sure. Uh, Definitely uh, test reaction time because if we know anything when, from uh, San Antonio, if somebody really went quick, away on a free, <laughs> and we're talking about five million pounds. Oh, 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 turned in. Off of Go on, lads. Carter Manley no, he's what a shot. Good shit, lad. Huge crosses in. 
for me is on the defender, and I, can't, I don't know if it's the Tamir we'll on the defender who goes into the bottom right. Lovely goal. I don't think we that play yet. That was gorgeous. Lovely turn into the box. Bang. He's there, bang. Yeah, it's definitely up the defender. 2-1. Good on Amir. I mean, he does. It's exactly the middle. It's ground definitely not going to penalties. It's definitely not. Exactly what was needed um, at that time. He and Hargis apparently is setting on him. Well, yeah, he's got pre-season. 2-1 was, yeah. Imposing figure from Lisbon. And they're not done in... Of trying put on to the wig. Strikers for this club. Not putting on the wig, mate. It's a friendly. Like it's a friendly. USL. <laughs> I haven't even put on my cap. Championship league sides in England as well to try to get lone oh, players yeah, down okay. from the Premier League and. Uh, goals a goal. The goals a goal. Yeah. Two, two goals Sunderland in this friendly. Year, a couple of great players. So, Diallo. I know we've had we've been seeing club like a couple of times, goals uh, down especially today, but from um, the Premier League. Couple of months as well. Bounce, held up um, by PC. No striker issues. Considering we have no striker right? issues, we still get a lot of goals. United loan. We've had 14 we goals last season. Incredible we'll addition there. Let's go into half time. That's exactly what Why they is this need. Goals scores. Uh, because you had the water yeah, break. The players we might and see in the second half, Jack Clark, who had like, it was, nine yeah, was, goals, which was third in the club huge. last season. He's been the subject of some loan talk. Gucci, Gucci, uh, Gucci. Gucci. In the the league and playing Somebody's foot's going to get onto it. Back in the Premier League after winning promotion this year. And How are we to the things you know? I feel like you brought that up. The equation as uh, well. You get I'm attention not, from some kids that are making the jump to the Premier League and Jack Clark. For me, the the, these preseason friendlies, yes, we're winning well. them, and it's good to see. It's also the issue here for the USL. We'll guys be able to back to the MLS put into practice how well we performed. You know, keeps things really in interesting yeah. in, in the division First game two and steps with leagues. That's cool. Oh, so sweet. sweet. Cool. If we make a signing, if we make a signing. Oh, lads. Oh, oh, if we make with a pass to Amir, if we go up to the end, goes up to the end. And uh, I think we should have made Ahmad a permanent position. And but sequence here of the opening half. They, they wanted 20 Second million. Corner of the match for Sunderland. For, um, I think that's too much for any player. Mm. The crowd has been electric here in the, the first 45 summer. minutes, 45 minutes to go. Sunderland with the advantage. Oh, they're they're that was a own goal here in stop time drum. at the end of the first half. They've got drums there. One they lead, but of course they do. Screamer from PC. Yeah, it's, it's the Pitch fans. Black there now. Of their seats um, midway through the opening half. This one drops in the box. San Antonio uh, makes the clearance, and, and that time. is how the right, opening cool. 45 minutes I comes to an end. It's 2 1 to the visitors from Sunderland AFC Chris. <laughs> going to mute the American. Right, can, I just, can I just point something out that I found hilarious, by the way? Derek said Burnley made a 12 million bid for Clark today. That's more than the Saudi League are trying to get Henderson for. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> no way, Jordan. Oh, so funny, honestly. Yeah, okay. So, um. <laughs> uh, they've changed the date available for the home kit, by the way. It was uh, written down as July 27th. Now it's late July. So, uh, Lisa our kit. Um, yeah, on the pitch. Yeah, uh, season calls and no one's seen a lot. Yay! Well, they were already available like the minute the season ended. <laughs> Why that... does it have your longitude and latitude on the side? <laughs> oh, I have no idea. I have no idea. Um, it's a nautical thing, so we we are a seaside city. So a lot of people right. actually know how in longitude and latitude is. So, fucking chips. Might be that. But yeah, um, anyways. Football wise, what do you reckon so far? Impressed? Not impressed? It's, Are we... it's been a been an alright game, to be honest. I mean, it's a friendly. I wasn't expecting much. Is there any, is there any areas that you think, like, we need massive improvement tomorrow, otherwise, struggle. Um, 
Patterson his toy cup. Yeah, but that's a difficult thing. That's not a quality. Yeah. Right. Um... No? <laughs> Off, the top of my head. Off the top of my head, no. Um, what about you, Paul? What's, what's your thoughts? Is there any... Well, what's your thoughts on the game, and there's any areas that we can uh, make you think? For me, I, I think I think we're, I think we're doing all right. It's, you know, like like I said, it, for me, for fair enough results. Yeah, it would be nice to win games in pre season, but pre season for me is all about uh, yeah, all about the fitness. Oh, hundred percent. Yeah, I think I think it's about the fitness. Um, Paul, what about you? I don't know really because um, the, well this is the first time we've actually played these. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cause it's, we're not in the same, not in the same bubbles, are we? Yeah, it would be interesting to know what uh, Mobius is uh, system at half time. Oh, um, I don't think there's going to be. I don't think there's going to be that much of a. Uh, Team talk, shall we say? So at, we're at half time now. As you can see in this bottom corner right here, it's eight o'clock. <laughs> God, it is. Um, it's... Um, it was season stuff. Um, um, but for me, I, I think defensively today we've got it pretty much bang on. Uh, the scores are, are right there, mate. Uh, you know, and two, Antonio one. Um. The defensively walk here, midfield I think we're looking a little bit disorganised and for me for me is actually looking quite solid. Um Yeah, this has been alright so far. Uh, <laughs> you, you can tell he's gonna be an absolute nightmare for the championship defenders, especially from corners. He's very physical. He's literally pushed two defenders off the ball already and they're all clean pushes with sheer strength. So um, I think if Hamir gets a strike partner, um, he will be the quick that kind of partnership. I'm a, I'm, a, I'm highly rating Hamir as a signing for a big. He's able to burst through pretty much what Mbidi used to do. Um, a little bit of what does as well, but with that, what big group. Um, Can you let me know when the game starts again? Yeah, the trend. The, 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 yeah, yeah. Uh, it'll be about five minutes. Focus on the bench, apparently. So, I'll go back to seeing. Now, see the, the bench, all in red, all about on the right. So, there is action happening. There is some warming up. On the bench, so we might make a couple of subs, but the entire bench was on him, so who's going to be? Yeah, I don't think it'll be Jack Clark because I seen earlier uh, a journalist said that Jack Clark's actually picked up a foot injury. If he if he doesn't, then... hey, uh, just, uh, uh, I'm just going to show the the, the... that one again. Uh, if you look in the top left corner, every one of those in the top left corner, uh, these guys here, um, they're all Southern players. And these are all Southern players. So all the Southern players haven't went in about on the about on the pitch. Even more. Quite, quite interesting to see how we're taking this three, three season is like really good. Training exercises. Everybody looks professional. That's <laughs> not a normal thing to see for us. Um, possibly. So, I'm I'm reading it. Well, I've just spotted uh, Durant is straight away. Massive, honey. Yeah, he is. <laughs> so, 
Um, I think our last year's problem with spending and might be a thing of the past, just because of how we've recruited in the summer. Like everybody's above six foot two, I think. I mean, six four. Bryant's is like six six. And who else we signed? Anderson was last in January, wasn't he? Anderson was in January transfer. Yeah, he was. Who was the other two signings? The Mace Mayo, Bellingham. Bellingham, he's 6'2. <laughs> and I'm forgetting to get you up. Um, and who else have we signed? We've signed somebody else. He hasn't really Jensen. Peaked. Sealed. Yeah, we haven't seen Sealed, have we? Um, he's 6'3 as well, so yeah. Defensively, should be a bit stronger with those big, big physical people. Um, set piece. The thing, the thing is though, with those set pieces in mind, do you think we'll still have the same issues as last year, or um, what do you think the track is for that? Oh, you're doing one here. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think we'll do better in set piece players next season? I hope so. Uh, yeah, as, especially with the the recruits, uh, the recruitment that we've got in at centre back. Yeah. Uh, where is it? Um, hey, it's a reserve team, man. No, 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 absolutely, mate. Like look, we're taking everything here as like just a a, a training game. It's 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 say, but um, we are only. Two weeks away from the start of the season. Yeah, so that so they've got three commentators. Yeah. Uh, so so what, what, there's yeah. a lot that just jumped on the stream. I think the guy in the middle's not commentator. I think it's uh, San Antonio's coming. Yeah. Um. The the signs are positive. I'm liking that. Yeah, he's he's one of their players. He's talking about joining. Yeah. Um. He's massive compared to them. Too. Anyways, the the showing good signs. I think for us, it's just keep our players away from any potential like major injury problems. If players are looking tired, sub them off, let them rest, and and go from there. I know it's a lot about getting some players. I'd like to see Chris Reid play for a couple of years. I don't think that's good. Yeah. It's about getting the legs fresh for the start of the season. Don't over let them just Yeah, being professional at stages. Quite refreshing. Usually just seasons of escape. Foreign country. <laughs> I'm glad to see that players are actually looking like getting the team. It's actually good to see Mowbray actually taking this game as well. Oh yeah, because he, he, he wasn't at one of the uh, pre-season, was it? He was at the first, I think he was at the Shields game, but not at the Gateshead one. Wasn't no, he right. was at Shields as well. He was at both of them, but he didn't take the games. He was just watching them. Yeah, he let... Um... Dodds and Proctor take the games. Oh, yeah. Um, which is, I have, I see Billy White, he got sent off in his first game for his new club, yeah, in the Singapore League. In the Singapore League. Um, it kind of, it's kind of case in point for, is something wrong with your mic? Can you hear me fine? Yeah, I can hear you completely fine, mate. Yeah, um, not, not sure then, Chris. Um, maybe it's your speaker. I don't know. Nobody else seems. To... It's okay. Um, Seals and Triantis. We haven't seen them in a sun and yeah. Good point, Alfie. No way this team will start the season. I don't think so either. Um, but a couple of players definitely will. Hamido. Hamido. Mia Hamido. Um, I think he will definitely start. Um, he. He's proven himself already, which I think is quite good to see. He reminds me a bit of Alice Sims, but 
me season. Yeah, Patson. Yeah, Patson. Tomato. After me, looks like we've made changes. Have we? Yeah, because my place is out now, warming up. It'll tell us at half time. It'll tell us on a, on a video card who's coming. Um, supercomputer predicted Sunland will finish 11. Well, the supercomputer, are you talking about 385? 385, what? Yeah, 358. 358 when there was five games to finish, finish 11. So, yeah. <laughs> Don't trust the supercomputer. They're not even five games ahead of time. Um, I genuinely think we could be competing the championship next season. I think realistically, Lord, probably going to be fifth or sixth. And Yeah, you know what I think we have made changes. Patson's not even that came out. Oh, yeah, we've got a keeper in a blue kit now. <laughs> so, got a different keeper on. Is it? Oh, here we are. Uh, I'll show you. I'll show you this then. I keep on. Yeah, we've made changes. Yeah, so Patterson is still in goal. Bath, Anderson's new. Bennett's is new. Hume is new. Ted is new. Bennett's new. Isaac's new. Mark, Taylor, Equa. We've basically made an entire... Oh, Bath, Bath is new as well. Yeah, we've, we've made the entire team. Well, the other one missing. Good chance. Yeah, Pat, Patterson's the only one that's stayed on from the first half, by the looks of it. Ah, no, I'll switch it back. <laughs> I'm gonna quickly grab grab a drink. He probably rest in uh, Pritchard because Pritchard did travel. Drink. Park <laughs> score one. Yeah, the fact that we've changed the entire squad for me is interesting. I would like to see some players get a full. That's more British choice, I guess. I think so. I would really like to see Chris Rigg because he's not going to be. He's, Chris Rigg's not going to be featuring like these um, heroes. I can see why Morby's done this, though, because yeah, he will want to see what Juventus is like. Yeah, because we're both friend of people with this ornament training, but... There's... Yeah, I agree, mate. There's... Merit to how we're playing this, though. Um, first off, for me, I can't really identify a lot of er areas that I'm concerned about initially. We didn't play a lot down the left-hand side. Um, really focused around. Robert. San Antonio FC Soccer on Valley Sports is brought to you by Toyota. Go to buy at Toyota.com. Visit your local. So I just can't do. And have San Antonio um, FC. Sunderland FC in international friendly here tonight. 2 1 Sunderland with the advantage. No the the Ipswich team already. The first half. <laughs> Keeper Anthony oh, Patterson. Yeah. The second half's the match, away, by the way, Lance. Yeah, yeah, 20 so seconds in. You're back. It's a whole new 10, I guess, so to speak. For San Antonio FC, Lamar Batista has a, come on to replace Carter read. Manley. Sorry, I'll read that again. So I think Patterson, there is at least three of saves there in the first half. Yeah, yeah I think and for it's Batista, these will be one, maybe two minutes. Right. Uh, the only minutes he's going to get for the next um, couple of weeks is. Yeah, I think we're going to struggle with this more for his keep asking uh, the recruitment team. Bro, Pato needs to wake up, man. Pato is the only player on the pitch that is still, um, but good that he's still on the pitch from the first half, by the way. We've made that's really wise 10 substitutions Marcino. of time. Jesus. Some game-like action, you just can't replicate that in practice. Players to watch for Sunderland here in the second half. 
Jack Clark Hudson, wearing Bart, number 28. Hudson, Bart, Anderson, Trent, Hume, Letetia, Bennett, Haji, Clark, Hiller, Eckler. Nine Hitler, goals Hitler. and 11 assists the, last uh, season. Thank you, Susan. And then Nectarios Triantis uh, is the Australian. Is that a tool for us? He is Hiller, making Hiller, his, his debut with the senior field. side wearing number 13. <laughs> Center back. Oh, 6'3", 196 good pounds ball. from Sydney. Oh, look at this. Oh, Sunderland will We've got a lot more here now. in the second half. <laughs> There's loads of hearts on. Um, That's me. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Imagine if every and 10 parts... And they US tour like, coming up on... Wednesday night, like they'll head next I would, the lab and I just set up a fucking robot United. to just do it for me. Before completing the trip yeah. next Friday night. In Cary, North Carolina against North Carolina FC of USL League One. It's got to be neat for them, of course, too, to be able to play in these environments. Unfamiliar. As we mentioned the one American There's on the no spot audio for me again. There's some mute. I'm sure it's, uh, Very funny. It's been a, a fun time for him. It. What time are you on? You see the uh, Antonio Academy players. Uh, 47. Starting to get loosened. 34, expect 35, 36. Yeah. Come on in this match. I'm like two seconds behind you now. Sometime here in the second half. What a treat so, for... Uh, oh. Those players, oh, Katie, started, and players players just of found all different Anderson ages from played, uh, it's, uh, 15 to 18. This is trying this is debut, huge right? Huge opportunity yeah, for the San Antonio is. Academy. I mean, you see it happen just, a lot uh, of the new in European teams. They, see you know, they bring these kids up from academy all the way to first oh, team. Oh, oh no, because he's injured. Oh, I think Clark's one of one. Clark. Oh, he goes for the cheeky little round the keeper. He brought the keeper to the defender. We can save the third corner of the evening. Said it once already, and I'll if, say if it again. He's got that engine that really never good. stops. He's that yeah, I've just got bulldog it. force there out on the pitch, oh, and wise on him to take that strong oh, diagonal. He was reading the play the as it panned out. Beat the, beat the, beat the, beat the Carlos take off an angle, and the picked done. up the rest. It's great defense. He's in that right? Who will not be putting the full match on? Jules and Bennett gives it a go. Bennett. The Costa Rican 19 year old in his second year with Sunderland. Well, here and, now with and with Amir out, they, they don't have a true striker. Bennett would they figure to be the lone striker in this case. You see, that um, Haji's actually been linked with a move away He's from the more of a false nine role. Um, Lahaji. No, I've not seen the link here, but. Foul um, called. Yeah, he's been linked with a uh, permanent move Jack Clark. <laughs> away from the club. If it's, if it's for decent money, then favoring good. his elbow a little bit here and his oh, one he's broke his arm. Attention. He's broke his arm. Yeah, I think how. he has. Looks like That's how I broke my arm. <laughs> Looking at that replay. Snapped. Did he, did he yeah, like, land on it? Yeah, he landed on it funny, but he landed on his elbow. Oh, he did. Oh, that looks painful. Uh, mine was probably so from like three feet from there, yeah, and down onto it, but like, yeah. He was that yeah, he, he knew that was broke straight away. My guess is Connor Maloney probably. I want to say the match. If you want to say the match, mate, there is links. Much longer. Uh, or you can buy it on SFC. San Antonio FC. Isaac to go to their bench once again here. Oh, of course Everybody they're not so friendly, so no substitute league. rules. Because money. Because money. But it's still not ended. It's not going to be entertaining. It doesn't matter, Sada. mate. Money. Money. Like when money. They're get, yeah. Mate, when they're getting offered, like, 50 million a year, why wouldn't they? Yeah, uh, uh, it's a San Antonio player, so I'm not sure. Names. Um, I've not seen them. Players yeah, that's 100% of the broken arm. Yeah, he's, he's broken his arm. It's a good show you again. Yeah. It's going to show you again. It's going to show you again. Yeah, that does. Oh, Malone, it's Maloney. Yeah, it's not a good arm. Oh, oh. 
Oh, wait, excruciating pain captured in HD detail. <laughs> It's 720p, mate, it's not HD. Chris Smith's got the best phrase for it, then. Money talks, idiot walks. I like it. Uh, no, I ca honestly, I can't blame them. Especially for players like Messi and like Benzema, who have only got a few years left to play anyway. Why not go to Saudi League and just make absolute bank? Fact, like, it's a smart move. I can't blame them. Well, I, I, I reckon Messi's going to retire in a couple of years as well. So if he's, he's like, he's already gone. Like, oh, I don't know, but most footballers retire by like 35, so he's technically already old for football. I know he went to, in, he went to, who did he go to? He went to Inter. Oh, Messi, he went to Inter. Um, I can't remember, he went to one of the American teams. I can't remember what he went with. Oh, I think it was Inter Miami, yeah. Yeah, into Miami, yeah. Yeah. Field, San Antonio. Uh, who was it? Look at the like, the Look at Ronaldo, he's he's getting on, he's probably only got a few years left in him and he's making Ronaldo's two hundred million a year. In yeah, exactly. The, he's in the Ryan Giggs era now. Then he's yeah. every last minute he possibly can, but Exactly. He's two hundred million a year. Why wouldn't you? Like you know you're gonna retire soon, why not just go make absolute bank before you retire? And then, you don't, then you're not stuck on the BBC commentators. Yeah, and then you can just you can just chill for the rest of your, you know, rest of your, rest of your parts of the game range and just make stupid amounts of money doing it. Here's, here's a question, because Tom has just said it, yeah, into Miami with Busquets. Ooh. Oh, I have no sound still. Going to listen to our conversation. Great opportunity yeah, the for Batista. Um, he's got that he's height. Batista, you know he can get on the end of it there. Right. Yes, he will. Case in point being his uh, first debut game on the pitch. It's probably right. At a bicycle um, kick. Bicycle kick. Yeah, for ninety, putting him um, on the back. I think it's probably his thing. Followed up by a hat. It's the name of the league. Oh, it's actually one of the. San Antonio area. Well, uh, I don't know. Not the MLS or the. Oh, it's not the name. And I can understand why, because that's exactly <laughs> Juventus. <laughs> Juventus next, yeah. Me, Man City next, please. For a Wembley final, maybe. <laughs> oh, what a tackle! That was great. Some of them have been decent, to be honest. It's not. They are playing very well. These are hard situations it's not like there. Frustrations are high, but you're attacking in the corner. Good time edgy seat stuff, but it's just solid quality football. It's not like people are, people are just not making mistakes. They're passing around the back. They're making one two movements. They're getting high Playing pressed. Smart. And, yeah, it's just. <laughs> Which is nice to see. Pressure coming. Yeah, like two players were, were surrounding. Anderson. I don't know who that was. Um, yeah, I think it was. Teddy had two San Antonio players pressuring him. And he he comes to the first delivery into the box. Goes to the second one, passes it to Patterson. Headed away. Yeah. Uh, it was Hamir that scored that goal, not Gooch. Uh, it wasn't even Hamir. Um, it was no goal. The numbers indicated are a little bit different. Then what Sunderland was wearing but the big nice USL. The first teamers USL a year ago. Yeah, the USL Championship will have the copyright so, on it. And I do, when I, when I show moments like this, let's, let's, let's the numbers that we should do it. If I show moments like this for more than seven seconds on my like other streams of the Championship games, the EFL tournament, not suddenly that tournament, it's the EFL. So, because this is a promotion gear that did Oh yeah, they will. One hundred. No Sunderland, just keeping things tricky. I reckon you score here. Positions and 
entire squad. Well, it's, Why not? It's, it's, yeah, mine. He went back to my yeah, field. Yeah, it's just here, mate. You keep us holding the ball in the sand. Unless he drops it. Unless he drops it, he gives it straight to whoever's... Oh, he's dropped it. He's dropped it. And, of course... Oh, one six second roll. There's been about ten now. It's eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifty. It needs to, it needs to, because keepers just take the piss with it. Man, he held the ball. Motherfucker held the ball for about twenty-two seconds and then just kicked it out for a throw. And anyway, what's the point? <laughs> That just made another change. Francis? Yeah, uh, Tony Pasco, captain. Entire game, just doing a great job of not only keeping that press alive, but keeping his team connected towards and backwards. I don't know who that is in the crowd, but. I think it's over for him. Yeah, you could hear them. I've got it off on that. The thing is, with us doing this kind of preseason as well. San Antonio, um, where else are we going? We're going to Seventh Cincinnati. Seventh international um, friendly for San Antonio FC since 2017. Help me out here. Where's our three pre seasons? Oh, oh my god. Good save from Patton. It's out there, commentary. Their commentary is just at. Um, I think I'm behind the game. It's in 2017. Just shy. You know, Six years he ago. Did a great job. Yeah, New Mexico and out. North Carolina. So I was getting Cincinnati and what Carolina mixed up. Force that ball to go um, wide. Maybe it's not Carolina closer. games there moved to 1 a.m. instead of midnight. So good they keep changing these starting there. times. There's Thursday at 2 o'clock, so I think that's Wednesday night. And Again, Dylan, one of those attackers that. Um, known for his play creation. Oh, I'll just increase the brand awareness. Careful, Danny Bass. In, makes in a difference when he's American in there. Territory, foul it? here looked pretty. Yeah, I, I don't know. I think we just like a hand to the head. Uh, right, I've refreshed. What time are you at? 50, 50, About five seconds behind. Uh, for like 135 million. Declan Rice for 135 million. Yeah. Arsenal there, got Joe robbed. Anderson. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, Arsenal got robbed. Declan Rice is an England is okay. starter. He is, he's in the starting 11 if he's fully fit uh, for England. So, that level, I think that, that that's at least 30 million. Then playing for how well he can perform in the Champions League. And only. I would probably sell him for maybe 50, 60. I think 55 is his yeah. proper market rate. But for 135, Steve Arsenal got. King Rob. <laughs> so, some people make him bang off that, that are not even involved in actual thing. Yep. Yeah. Asian's face, that's very late across the pond in Sunderland tonight. We thank you for Still, us on the 55 is the, the right rate for Rice. So he says 34 for Timber and 105 for Rice. Rice 105 is actually stupid. That's like. He's not worth that. Oh, we're Maguire. 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 Oh, with that, there's a hundred players worth over a hundred million. Nah. No, no, no. Checked. Bursting down. Hook down. Nobody there. And it's Clark. Clark on the bridge of the box. I see the weirdest shot I've seen in the last. He does do like his, he does like his curlers, but that was well wide. That was really good. That's the skill of Jack Clark, the native of York, England. Oh, boy, yeah, that was hella wide. 
Tim, Tim Bubble. Tim Bubble for 34 matches. million. I think that's a fair price. It's a really solid distribution. It's hard to get on the end of that because you can see he's trying to get the ball off. There's still a bit of a bounce. I don't know. Probably not. I probably would have gone lower as well, to be honest. Only two year old. It's still a really great look. Born in Utrecht. Depends where he's come from. Ajax. Yeah, he's an Ajax player. Ajax are good at over-egging the value of the young players. Yeah, fast for water all massively. I should have paid about. They should have probably. They probably should have paid about eighty mil for both. Off the board, eight, eight zero. Yeah. You're seeing fifty-five. You're seeing twenty-five for Timber. Yeah. Foot skill and ability. He can just hold on to the ball. It's one of those guys you can really put anywhere. Remember the day when Tony Cruz and Gabby Alonso. So look, with pressure coming. Yeah. And Bennett and Clark there. This is Equa. And we in the thought midfield. that was a silly run money. Past but the fact that Abu. We, we could have guessed. This sounds really. And Bended will earn a free this kick. sounds really, really bizarre now, but we could get Mishu now on a free. In theory. Trey Hume getting. I'm come back to him. His first action of the preseason after. And the cheek of PSG asking for 5 million. Didn't release him. With the <laughs> national team in Northern Ireland. From Challenge Human Grove being worth five million to today being worth literally Gohansen. is monthly wage. Right there as Sunderland wins possession of the ball as Equa. Out of the tackle. How is Hamir today? So Hamir has gone off at half time and he's played really well. Not only doing um, a great job to move as a unit to close really, things really down, but even when the, things get kind of sticky, they just kept their cool. I think he's, he's, he's more towards the win of it's more like sims than um anyone name on oh, name on psg was a san antonio fc well. continues the homestand next saturday night they'll take on miami fc second ever meeting with miami that fc transfer i think the Mbappe one again everything two weeks from tonight to complete the homestand oh so, sorry um sorry dog but i'm gonna bring it up as well they are not the the allison purchase in miami right now <laughs> with the arrival no way of one goalkeeper ever be that expensive. Mel Messi this uh, past okay, week as he gets set for his MLS debut coming million. up next Saturday night for Inter Miami of Major League Soccer. You know, I don't think any of anyone in Miami is ready for what Messi has to bring. Yeah, sixty-five million in all currency. Like him best in but to be fair, he is one of, if not the best goalkeeper in the Premier League. Through the MLS. Yeah, whether he's... you're in Inter Miami or Miami FC, you're still in the vicinity there. Yeah, so. to be fair. Definitely. He's the best. He is the best friendly keeper at the minute. Just with his family, just shy, shopping, shopping, shopping at Publix. <laughs> Casually. That reminds me, actually, of United signed a new goalkeeper. I remember For some reason, David my mind has gone completely blank the on who the Man City Galaxy keeper is. Major League Soccer. Edison. Is obviously at a Edison. That's it. Yeah. yeah. His career. But I mean, the, the he level went for like of excitement as well. and, and super as well. Uh, I don't know how much money. To American but... soccer. Um, I mean, yeah, I don't know. Allison, I Allison is definitely better than that. Messi duplicates oh, yeah. that said. excitement created by Beckham. Right. Well, the thing with Beckham uh, is not only was he really still good, but he was a good looking guy. Oh, there they go. They got Edison for 34 mil. I mean, he's everything. He was living the life. It was Hollywood. Get to get his back. Get to get his back. The hair is back up. He's not good with the sun. 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 Not a century. Saudi charge came in the clock transfer. 200. This is something a little bit different than what Beckham brought. He's bringing not only star power, but he's bringing incredible. That's oil money for you. Yeah. That is oil money. In the yeah, the Premier League is out. He has the massively increased the price of every player that they will get. And Sony FC, what a strike it was. He used to be able to get. Just off for free kicks. Caught the keeper napping off his line. Caught the keeper napping off his line. Caught the entire team play five million. And PC in perfection. Went years in the middle of the park. <laughs> about ten years after that, you get yeah, think about it though. The more, yeah, the, the more money the pumped into it, though. Yeah, but 
Oh, they just showed. They just showed the um the goal from San um, Antonio. Oh, what is Pato doing there, man? Oh, you mean the first goal? Yeah. yeah. The game was on about three hundred and fifty thousand. Probably spend that on like. Would have loved to see a run a little bit team. earlier from Nico Hansen opening up for Bailoni. Bailoni had hold on to it. Well, fucking, they've offered um, the Saudi club after Henderson offering him 700,000 a week. Yeah, I thought they scored there. Sunderland. Yeah, it's been a bit. Yeah, it's been a bit shaky last few days. Uh, last few days, last few minutes. The last few days. <laughs> you know, we talk about uh, this how is looking? Um, before I get into that, so let's have a look back oh, here. Good question. Did a great job just to All create right. some space. He's not being. He's not being. He's not being challenged that much. He puts a block in when he needs it. Well. But uh, his passing is decent. That, it's um, well, direct. It's like fast. Friendly, um, it's not about. Space. The score line, right? It's not about the lost away with the win, it's about the little pieces within the game that matter. Young talent coming out, the big opportunity, seeing how they fit in and mesh with the first team. But he's alright, he's doing alright. And uh but you can't help but wonder, you know, it's two one. We're getting into the final minutes of the game. You know their competitive streak is kicking in. You can't tell me that they don't want to win this. Well, hundred percent, especially for those that are coming out, the seventeen year olds, Mateo Gonzalez, the latest. Five foot ten defender out of the I SAFC Pro the Academy, part Giovanni Padilla, just turned seventeen a couple of months ago. There with the eighteen-year-old Jeremiah Posada. I think they're getting tired to be honest. San Antonio players. Yeah, they look. They look. They looked tired about twenty minutes ago. The bench to his team. This is good training for them. I don't think they used to uh, play, both play this like this. Notice both and Marcina sitting in their chairs, right, is not this Sam's doing a ton of coaching on the here. View? I think it's just a good opportunity Who's to Sam? see what the players do on their own accord. Yeah. If this is some like bees nuts joke or something, I swear to God, I will ban you. And enjoy a little bit of what's going on in front of them. I don't know who Sam is. Just a, a little bit more relaxed than. Typical Saturday night in USL Championship. USLA. No need to uh, risk this is pretty much what we've been watching for the last like seven minutes. Of sort, right? All of, in and around this area. Outside the box oh. Yeah, it's might have been it's been staying in midfield for quite a while. I really like it when the coach well. allows us to see what these guys all do on the into the park, but... I think it's very telling about yeah. players as their character, their IQ, the way they're moving. It's been it's been all right, to be fair. I mean, um, been the system of play for San Antonio is nothing new, he's been on the right? Ball. So it's probably not a ton of coaching that needs to be done in the moment anyway. Hansen trying to run down this service. He's putting it in a shape. No real pressure on him to do. 20 minutes remaining. Ah, in Sam. With Sunderland. Oh, Ahead by one. Um, San Antonio. Nothing on the sheet here in the second half. Did San Antonio make both changes? No, they've made um, changes every like five, ten minutes since coming second half. Anderson, <laughs> make the so on the voice call, we have Paul and David. Hello. Releasing up the Hello. Looking for Hello. Lahaji. Hello. Hello. We haven't heard from you exactly for a while. Uh, took his time throwing that one in. San Antonio had come yeah, over. Yeah, I'm trying to, trying to keep quiet because my dad's asleep. Scream. No, I can't. <laughs> He's actually up at uh, 4.45 in the morning. Play it out. Work. Pressure there from Mateo Gonzalez. 4.45. Times he start. 45 over on the far side. He leaves the house at 6 in the morning. Come Why is he looking out at more academy players? Yeah. Yeah. 75 minutes before he's going out. Join for these. Final 20 minutes of the <laughs> yeah, match. Just... It's really bizarre. <laughs> I get up. Eduardo Fernandez getting some. I get up 20 minutes before I need to leave. 20 minutes. Yeah, I get up, get dressed, 
like have some coffee, clean my teeth, go to the toilet if I need to, and then leave. You put extra steps in there for no reason. Up, toilet, teeth, players, That's like, well, it's, it's, if I if I don't really have coffee, like then I'll just I'll go clean my teeth straight away. But then if I drink coffee, I'll go through coffee and then I'll do the rest of it. Uh, make a big pass. Oh, what a Great save from the keeper. Offside for the corner. Trying to recover. The whistle, the ball will return back to Mercado. The technique was offside from the ball on Ekwa's shot. Ekwa's shot here. Clark with the never-ending engine has no problem with the on? full speed there in the yeah. attack. Great but, set. Ah, uh, the flex, that's why. it was interesting Stuart to hear Jordan the, uh, Farr at the half talk season. about his relationship with Carlos player. Mercado and um, along with we'll Chuck Rosser, the academy keeper, and points. they all season, which is work together interchangeably, whether it's training on the first side um, or Rosser's case. That's, that's my very early prediction. Taking what he learns and bringing it back down to the academy level. And interestingly <laughs> enough, because of we've touched on this a little bit, the keeper situation with Sunderland, uh, Rosser and a couple other the academy vision. keepers yeah, actually had to train with Sunderland in these last couple so of days just to basically fill out the, the roster formally, so to speak. Again, an incredible opportunity and for them to learn from some world-class coaches. Oh, oh, the turn from turn. Haji, the save from Carlos Mercado. Oh, the Haji. Great turn and great uh, save there. Mix up, uh. Could have had a little more pace on it. Might have got higher. The Haji's in Equus' position. Great lead. Clark, the tackle from the Tino Gonzalez, Sailor Taylor. Well, Haji. Um, Haji. Um, before Sunderland begins to get what? dangerous when they have time to pass oh, around and find the pocket. You give the two. So much having to That's sprint to get on the end of it. I'm lucky there for Clark, okay. though. Stuart needs to get off the pot. My well, Stuart's agent needs to stop pissing us around. Because if it, if it does, it's going to create that bit of um, sense and resentment towards him. Yeah, it's Carlos on that one. Yeah, oh, yeah. This is quick movement. Prime position to stop that one. Just the tail end of that shot. Yeah. 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 What we'll time you at, lads? I did. I think it's back up with me. Mitchell Tainer, each enjoying a well-deserved night off after the win in El Paso on Wednesday. By the way, belated happy yeah, birthday to Fabian so, Garcia. It's, it's, turned 29 as well. yesterday. Again. Good for him. Getting out there, there and wreaking havoc. Water break, water break. Water, 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 water break. Right for soccer. But uh, I'm going to quickly well, just do you're something. You're just joining us. Take a look at the action to uh, this point. 2-1 nice. Sunderland well, lead. See. They open the scoring Thing. 15 just, minutes into the match. It's the youngster yeah. Chris Rigg. Zico Bailey slips one past the keeper Mercado. And then the goal of the evening from the captain PC on a set piece from the center of the park. And that just before the half. The fortunate own goal by Carter yeah. Manley on the service yeah. in from Niall Huggins with... Amir, the runner in the vicinity, and that has been it to this point. 2 1 Sunderland. One Instead final quarter hour remaining scene, in, in this international friendly. <laughs> all in all, a very right. equally matched so, game. Go more messing around. Phil Sunderland getting 
any dodgy streams on? Liam, there is, um, but I can't give them out. Uh, they are very easy to find. Deal with that with what you will. Um, just search for San Antonio, not similar. Um, Good to have Shannon back after he was waiting for the pitch uh, uh, off nice the Premier League, but I think uh, he needs to get fit. Exactly. He's not going to get an offer. For me, Ross Stewart is not getting an offer from the Scottish League from the Premier League that was, while he's injured, that was a treat and for he's been out pretty much since he gets two matches in the, gold the end of January. His third and fourth caps five as a member of the national so, club, so congratulations to him. Always uh, an honor when you get to represent your, your country at the he world should level. Sign a long really, contract, it's really, and it's ex an experience um, that not many months. players get to have, so the I fact that St. Antonio has a guy of that caliber on their team the January transfer just brings a lot, a lot of so quality. Just from this perspective, treat them like he's the out. His agent are not familiar names to with those who follow the USL Championship, uh, particularly from those Island I don't squads. think it's him not I don't think it's Tobago. Stuart himself. I think it's a agent. Think it's a Nevis. As many of those yeah. players well, like, uh, Josh feature situation. in USL Championship. I feel like a Josh Madger situation, yeah. I think Josh Madger would have stuck around with Sunderland if we, um, if we gave to their contract demands. It's a giveaway for Sunderland. I don't Sunderland. think we've learned from Eduardo that. Eduardo Fernandez with his first touch since coming on. So. Mohamed Abu is now That's wearing the armband. That's Leon Madger. I know, I know he's a free agent. Clips one would you bring box. him back? Um, if he doesn't have his agent Sunderland with him, the yes. And if it's yes. just dealing with him Echo direct, his way. or a new agent um, that we trust. Oh, 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 back up. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, Echo Clark sees Clark in space on the oh. left side, driving forward. Well placed ball. And the shot is From just Echo. about half a yard. Clark to just a little bit off of that right left foot. Side. Really and beautiful development. As you can see, Echo <laughs> doing a great job to just pull. And here it is on the big screen. Uh, that, was very, that was very. That was very. That was very. That was six feet too wide. <laughs> Man, yeah, from that angle, it didn't look too bad. No surprise that Burnley is throwing a big number potentially out at Sunderland to maybe acquire the rights. Yeah, I don't like the fact that they don't have their names on their shirt. Preseason. Their season in the English Premier League. Yeah, he's just mentioned that the, the commentator from San Antonio has just mentioned that Burnley are interested in really Jack Clark. Toughness, right, I think, that. Out here in the situation, not a ton of players Everybody on the pitch. Pitch. What we think still making are we all just not having him fuck off? Really but you, no, you your, can have him if they have a, box, a reasonable, in and out, decent offer. They, we paid 15 million for him, right? They've offered seven. Told them no. Oh, They've offered eight. Sunderland. We told them no. They offered years nine. We told them no. There's now offered the thirteen. This what we're going to tell him. No. no. <laughs> if, if we're looking at like twenty-two to twenty-five million, the then I think that's a serious bid. At the minute, it's just the, the, the low ball meaning is off. It paid more for a fucking these goal. Players, they're they're obviously looking at him. The same opportunity. If they're still going to, the goalkeeper is going to be second. And the goalkeeper is going to be second. Right, that's what's so difficult about moving to the next level is, you know, is the player as an individual. If they're offering such a low value for him, for me, that is, we want you on our bench. We don't want you to play a first team. We want you to come in and make a change in that 70th minute onward. You get some That's really not what he wants. He wants USL, first team. And I know it's he the same there for the championship. You can tell by the way he plays. The give and take is that a lot of times when you move up a level, you just don't get the breaks, same minutes. Breaks past the struggle is hard, but it's also to. a chance that you have to it's take. Otherwise, it can pass you by. Passing game. Move on. That was a really nice heel flick. Clark is definitely friendly. Come on, that's. Grab one ball. Someone's in the box with literally. San Antonio oh. players not putting his foot in at all. Hooks it in, oh, blocks it, and header. By the way, I don't know if you just saw the image of the ball there a moment ago. Man, he's doing work. The EFL Sky Bench well Championship work. ball that they use in the Jesus. championship. Was that Clark on the wing there? Yes. The yeah, don't tell me. Yeah, don't tell me. Between the USL <laughs> yeah, it's really, it's, I think it's genuinely it's great. the EFL, the Sky Bench. I understand why they're really interested in getting the ball's the same, ball, right? But, yeah, I it mean, was we wearing with his feet though, that was great. Branding and style and, you know, th there's 13 million is their biggest their offer. Four times but, asking. You know, I think it's everything. Just the MLS just you released, say Burnley, uh, but you're not having them. The Tell them to Crystal Palace for 20 million or whatever. You're just not having them. So, you, you completely um, me, not, off now. DC. 
DC Four times. Oh, yeah, Marvel. Yeah. Yes. Gosh. It's nobody, nobody fired. Uh, Thank you. Yes. Set fire to me at the stake, please. I think the equivalent is like going to. I know I probably just upset two different crowds that don't like. Yeah. Uh, okay, no, okay, no quid. That's way too much. So it's definitely a thing. Um, I actually have a comic themed ball that the English Premier League released. Yeah, quid costs four quid, mate. Come on. Huge Wonder Woman fan. Quid, a quid. A pint costs four quid. And definitely gave some Marvel and Wonder Woman vibes. Four three dudes. My guess is that and we're being told that they played with the USL championship no balls in the first half the second half playing with the English championship ball. I don't know. It's still up front. And it's still up front at the minute. Um, and, and when I saw it, that's what Yeah, it's was interesting with Taylor actually because, um, as you know, Anthony like to watch um, Hartlepool sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> um, as a bunch of Hartlepool fan, then, they said actually... Search this out. Yeah. That should have been a penalty there. Um, the Hartlepool fans said apparently Ellis Taylor didn't play any games while he was on loan there. He didn't play any? Kind of lucky nah. there. There wasn't a penalty called in. What's your point in that movement? Great greed. Really? He's going to play. Position as he gets back yeah, to his feet. Uh, couldn't he train with our What? That makes no sense. He was was he there just in case? Balls for tonight's that championship. Was. There it is. The right, is this going to be the penalty? That we used in the first should have been. No, that's just the championship ball. There's the ball. Uh, here in the second. Just the, just the ball. Wouldn't mind one of those, you know? Yeah, there's a collection. What's the ball? I'm surprised, right? You At the minute, we have 46 people. Why are we on the up? So we have nothing. We have nothing bad to do. Right. Who might have the San Antonio FC sprinkling in a nice assortment of their academy players to close out this one. Who's got next? Uh, no, there's not going to be enough goal. We're 83 minutes in. Nobody's had a reason. Never say season. never. Um. <laughs> we'll take uh, FC, 8 o'clock. So you had to go get your tickets to SanAntonioFC.com. You can watch all the action right <laughs> here on Valley Sports. Never say oh, never. never. I've had the pleasure, though, of having Katie Goodman up here with us. She is headed to Australia for the for Women's like, World Cup. Oh, well. Uh, Congratulations. Thank you. I'm you should have done excited. like tacos yeah, or quesadillas. Uh, the time in LA and then uh, the other time in Australia, just more. learning and setting the broadcast. Yeah, it's looking really nice. So, yeah, nice very pumped you. for uh, that. And, uh, oh, thanks. I see you too. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm st I've I'm still got, you know when um, okay, DJ yeah. changes his name to Cabby. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I've still got Dolph, my go to for you. Gonna get, it's, I'm gonna get used to it. It's fine, you're for it. Uh, you're not a dog anymore. Uh, hey, David. Say oh, hello in the chat. Anderson. <laughs> uh, sleep schedule. Oh, yes, and we have work on the Cheers. I don't, I'm lost Monday. <laughs> is it 2M the, um, is that 2M the championship match? Right now from <laughs> yes. <Mowbray>. Huh? <laughs> on the bench. I, uh, the I don't hear the coach, I mean obviously our so mics are positioned more really towards the visitor coaches. and coaches. I do not hear the USL championship uh, coaches as vocal uh, as we hear from the manager of Sunderland yeah. AFC tonight. Any dodgy streams right, on? Yes, there is. You know, sometimes there's yes, there some is. coaching moments. Mate, there's only about five minutes left to the end. I wouldn't bother this. You know, yeah, you want to let the guys it's, play. It's literally like it's in the middle of the pitch. See what they can work out on their own. That's but, been, you know, sometimes it's the well, in the moment the coaching that's everything. You want to see how they course correct feedback. You're in a minority there, David. I have a, I had a community yeah, call and... Trying to serve it up here for the aforementioned Ellis Taylor. I, I like it's probably also a rarity this is like that a solid eight out of ten. you can actually hear yeah. the coach in uh, a game Like I keep saying, like your stadium, kits so this season are better some, than some of the Premier League teams. Anywhere, but maybe two feet in front oh of yeah, have you seen the Minecraft Liverpool one? Oh uh, yeah, it's horrible. We don't talk about that. So we forget it exists. The next stop, it's the <laughs> what are you going to be playing? Get to third keeper internet. for San Antonio FC. No, 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 no. Keeper from the academy. He's gonna come on for Carlos Mercado. Uh, it's not, it's purple. Because it's, it's not purple. pink and blue. Purple. 
Um, Heaves his way so in it's, the middle. It's a monoprone. Um, Trey Hume. Lahaj. It is it's the same shade as purple. Speaking of international the, play, oh. Trey Hume, one of those guys who just spent some time same with the Ireland Irish national team just last month. This roster actually riddled with guys who have oh, played so for exactly their national exactly. teams at some point, whether it's U16 to U22 right. or the senior teams. I could so deal with any proper night. Time World Cup comes mm -hmm. around or Gold Cups or anything. There's just a lot of change. And it's so really kind of like a And just speaks yeah. so much about the caliber and the quality of this team through and through. So Mercado comes off, Jude Brosser will come on here. Oh, the majority of keepers just stand there and look pretty all game and then occasionally have to make a save. Oh, yeah, he's pretty ugly. Pretty yeah, pretty to pretty see him pretty some pretty minutes and, and you know he's probably feeling the same. Seems like it belongs further enough. Uh, 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 like to see a, a penalty shootout between the academy <laughs> players. If they score now, I'm going to be upset. Some of the best. One thing I miss with the English Championship is a To be honest, the best stitch on the team is stitch. That you couldn't it's pay money for. The bad badge is slapped on top. I just love the trust mind. that Marcelo puts in his academy as well. I was looking at some stitched embroidered well, shirts on Amazon the other day. Solid minutes and against quality teams. We saw it in the Lamar. They can't even make out half the details on the badge. Academy but the, the, the Latin on the badge? I can't read it. In San Antonio. Mm. Give us another and goal, lads. I don't think they're going to. I think it is going to end 2 uh. 1. Giovanni Padilla. Padilla, the FM tips. It's the night down Pence. That's it. Well, well I'm glad you asked. <laughs> Great defense from Padilla. It's a, it's a member uh, of the ball 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 ball. Continue the movement. But uh, David, define David as a member. Quality player in the main channel. Game spec. Oh, Playoffs. No, oh, they have champions this time. I think so. That's, that's yeah, definitely. Giveaway. Eduardo Fernandez. I'm just going to show they have this. Oh, what a save, Papo. Oh, who was that? They should have leveled up. What the... That's an... That's an eight and saves. Bacho. This should have been... Here we are. It's going to be here. Number 49 drives it. It's insane. Just in the middle out of reach. Eleven cross over. Look at that sly tackle, man. Just a few inches shy of being a goal. Oh Jim my Anderson god. Slide tackle oh, is what's get out. a piece of that to that allow not going his keeper to come net. back over and save it. <laughs> really good defender. Before it crossed the line. There's the turn from Lahaji. I had a CFA. Pushing Trying to up. search out Jewison and Bennett. It's the Pinguin. Mar pinguin. Batista. <laughs> Don't ask for a goal if, you, if you're not willing to have San Antonio One score. More time, a look at the... The chance for Andres Bacho. It was going on goal if the one. It's going on wrong goal. Yeah, yeah, no. Who is it? What a slide tackle, man. You can see in the background. Oh, did they score? Uh, Wait, why is Susan saying no? Went off. They thought it was in. I think it's for that. A little trigger wrong. happy back yeah. there. You know, I it's a missed wrong. goal, but you have to commend well, them well, on the IQ that no. got them there in the first place. They were bursting the into a box that went quiet. The speed of play, <laughs> uh, uh, you know, getting that ball across the five uh, in general. Someone's are in their final third, but we're not. We're not looking at. Uh, oh no, that's a back to. Oh, that's a slide tackle. Here at the end of the second half, 
Just what has been a, a fun night tonight. San Antonio FC, Sunderland AFC, the 2 SAFC going head-to-head. Head. I made himself. The Black Cats the and the Sunderland AFC. Sunderland AFC going head-to-head. Well, yeah, the Los Gatos Blancos, if you remember, for San Antonio FC from a couple of he years ago, getting the no. nickname when the he went hell white off. cat raced out onto the pitch in the middle of the match against RGV. Are they called the white Some cats? of the similarities between the yeah, sides, they are. SAFC acronym, colors, red and black, cats, black and white cats. It was meant oh, to God. be. <laughs> Oh, that's funny. The commentators are, are literally clutching that Unlikely straws now. San Antonio FC's hospitality uh, <laughs> over the last three days for a club like Sunderland. That will pay off in the long run as well, too. Points, think, certainly will um, the the it certainly will open the door for other international friendlies moving forward. More teams will certainly want to take advantage of not only the opportunity to play stateside, but playing in 100 degrees in the middle of July. <laughs> right, well, fun fact, actually, Sunderland went and trained at Davies Gym, which is a big warehouse that had the gym, and they put on a lot of boxing fights, and, uh, you know, uh, all kinds of fights and, and events. And then they had some of these guys actually minutes. suit up boxing each yeah, other for training wise, and second half, you can I'm see they impressed. were sweating they're out of breath and um, it's really great training if you're, you're padded up and guarded yeah, I, I believe Joe yeah. Bellingham uh, I think defensively and Danny Ballard out were now. the two winners for Sunderland AFC they won the belts in uh, the boxing match at Davies Gym here's Abu an opportunity to go from distance we've not kept the clean the entire preseason headed out the first yeah. half, first half attack in second half defense would be gas. great. Just actually, oh wait, Manu just got to the They literally just dragged him to the floor. Hey, do you like the taste of dirt? <laughs> oh, yes, maybe even a red. Two hands on the shoulders. Go on. Final run into the box. What? Oh yes. Oh yes. Oh, yes. Tremendous night. Look who scored it. Bro, I hate being behind, man. He's got the final goal of the evening for Sunderland. Oh, he absolutely slapped him silly now. Is that the Hachi? Speed though, no, that's, in, in extra time, true. in this kind of environment with the heat. Didn't seem oh, yeah, Jim, Jim, Jim beats Just one guy, one, maintains two. his composure. Oh, it's the same goal as the Wickham's Rashu uh, goal. Yeah, it That's is. Great stuff from him. <laughs> it's really hard as a keeper to read that. There's so much traffic going on. Let so me just put the chat. Yes, here. So it makes sense. <laughs> Catching any keeper <laughs> off guard really in that situation. Good, good stuff. Wilson getting on the score sheet as well. Costa Rica, 19-year-old, one That's... goal in 15 matches a year ago with Sunderland, hoping to be more of an Come integral on, part on there. Uh, we always forget about Joey being the striking option. And the streams just stopped. It's gone in slow motion. I think it's, it's beyond the 90. You, you only pay us for 90 minutes of service. Um, oh, it's gone. That's why the lights have gone out. Yeah, the lights are out now. <laughs> oh, we won. I think Pot Frog. He's doing that with the visitors from Sunderland. That's full time. I think it's full time, yeah. Yeah, it is. Uh, I think with um, this all, this is this is genuinely. Um, three one. That's kick him again. I've got it. I've got it muted. Um, I think apart from Jackson not being in the right spot for that free kick. Yeah, I, 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 why, I don't know why he was stood where he was stood, miss. That's a, that's a one for... To be fair, other than that, we something have been decent and really, really just professional, clean, not putting anything too brash in. I like what I've seen so far. Do you want to, um, let each of you give a quick little say what you think? <laughs> it can't be just the... On, yeah, three one full time. 
Uh, it can be the one incident with Patson. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He's a goalkeeper, not a dock keeper. <laughs> it is. It is showing. It is showing the highlights now, rather than the live feed of video. Um, when the goals come up, I'll, I'll turn them on. Uh, yeah. The is the first first goal. No, it's not. Basically, I will copy it for second son and goal. Um. Paul, what are your thoughts, mate? Yeah, it's the same as yours, but uh, I'll say my favourite goal. I, I'm going to have to say, Joey. The, the, the carbon copy of Roscoe's. Yeah. Yeah. It was just it was out of the blue, um, tied off at the end of the night. Um, the entire second half could have just been. <laughs> If that goal didn't happen. That's the kind of thing that we felt that, that that late goal, that ninety second half minute or ninety three, is what will be what exactly what we need in the normal season. Be a games where one nil behind and we'll need that last minute kind of thing. So for me it's it's all positive signs. Yeah, the first half was definitely. Um, I, I just enjoyed that. That was fun. Yeah, it was a good game. Not sure. <laughs> I'm not sure if I'm going to be doing the Wednesday, Wednesday night, Thursday morning one because obviously, shifts. Still. Um. Weekend, I, I think I'll definitely be doing the North Carolina. What time is that one? Uh, one o'clock. Yeah, okay. this, this, this was supposed to be one o'clock. They changed it years before. So it's... They might have fucked up the um, time difference. No, 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 they've literally changed it. So it was originally 12 o'clock, 2 o'clock, and 2 o'clock. Messing the, the times. These are all you. Yeah. Um. And it's been it's uh, New Mexico Thursday morning. I think that if I am around. Yeah. Um, thank you very much. See you soon. See you years later. Bye. Mm. <laughs> this helps me.